All right, everyone, welcome back. Thank you so much for stopping by. I appreciate it. So it has been brought to my attention that my friend was jokingly talking about how to turn a three-way switch into a single switch um, because he is doing some house remodeling. Um, and I told him he should make a YouTube channel because he's like completely redoing his whole house, like painting cabinets, doing sheetrock, just like literally everything, just taking everything apart, redoing his whole house. It's actually pretty incredible. Um, so I told him to make a YouTube channel and he said he probably will. So anyways, I think I'm going to his house on Friday, but I just want to give you guys a prep video on um, explaining how to turn a three-way switch into a single gang switch, or not even a single gang switch, three-way switch into a single pole switch. Um, so I drew out right here your normal three-way switch if it just had a power coming in and then one three-wire going between and then a single two-wire up to a light. Um, so if you are familiar with any of that, then this will make sense. Um, it is a little bit to comprehend at first. So we got um, the black is my power, which is going to my power uh, common screw. And then the red traveler goes to the red, uh, the red traveler wire is on both of the red screws, which is, these two are actually gold screws in real life. Um, and then the, the white little screw I drew here, which is the other traveler on the black. And then the blue is the neutral, which is actually white. Um, so those are tied together in the boxes. The power goes on that screw. Uh, your grounds is pigtailed to each um, of the switches. And then you got your switch leg going into the box up to the light. So that's the three-way situation right there. And I'm going to draw and show you guys how to turn this um, same scenario, two boxes or two switches into uh, a single gang, a single pole switch. I don't know why I keep saying that. So if it's, if it's just one wire, which is probably not the case, you might have actual more wires in your box. But um, take your power wire and then um, that's pretty much just going to go, um, that's just going to sit right on your switch already correct me if i'm wrong um so i got my power wire which is going straight to that um, first let's get rid of all the neutrals so these neutrals are just going to tie together these neutrals are just going to tie together these grounds are should already be tied together because they're already on a switch so these are either going to be pigtailed or tied together um if it, if you want to unpigtail it you can because basically you're probably just going to blank off this plate over here because um, you're only going to have one switch anyway. So basically just going to blank this off. Um, and you're going to take your switch leg and then on this side you're going to take your switch leg um, and then wire nut that to either one of these wires. So um, either one of these travelers you can pick red or you can pick black. Um, but just know which one color you use. I'm going to use black. So black is going to be my switch leg. And then instead of having two travelers, because it's there's the, you're getting rid of the switch, you're not gonna need two travelers. So you're basically just tying the switch leg right through. So you're gonna basically delete this red wire or not use it or cap it off, whatever you wanna call it. Um, so I'm just gonna tie the switch leg together in this box. And then over here, we're just gonna take that black wire coming in and then just put it right on our switch. And that's pretty much it. I uh, already forgot to mention the pigtail for the ground right there. And then basically you just cap off the red wire right there. And that's how you turn a three-way switch to a single pole switch. Um, and then, yeah, obviously, like I said, you blank that off. And then it basically you just power in and then switch leg all the way back up to your light. So it's basically just a little junction box. Um, so that is how to turn a three-way switch into a single pole switch. So hopefully you guys found this video informational. It was actually explain that a lot faster than I thought I would. Um, so anyways, should be going to my friends on Friday, if not uh, very soon to help him out. Um, he actually has a whole bunch of cameras. So maybe I will actually do like my first professional video on like a real camera, or I'll just bring my tripod and my iPhone. So we'll see, might get an actual professional video. So stay tuned for that. Hopefully we'll do that Friday. Um, so that'll be fun. And I'll introduce you to my friend. And if he has a YouTube channel up by then then i'll link it in the description or something like that so anyways guys thanks so much for watching i appreciate it as always if you enjoyed make sure to like this video it would help the channel grow and i'd appreciate it i'd love to see you guys back in the next video um with that said don't forget to subscribe so you can see the next video and then uh check the description down below for anything else 
Um, the first link down below at the link tree is going to have pretty much everything. My social media, my second YouTube channel, my gaming channel on Twitch, all that good stuff. Um, and then don't forget um, to hit the notification bell to be notified when I upload your live streams. Doing a giveaway soon at 10,000. You're going to be there in like 10 days or less according to the internet on Social Blade. Um, so stay tuned for that. Going to do a huge giveaway. And thank you guys so much for the support. Landing my first sponsorship here soon. I uh, just have to sign the contract. So thank you so much. And I will see you guys back tomorrow in the next video. God bless. Have an awesome rest of your day. Peace out.